Hi, this is Gordon with Arizona One Real Estate at My Home Group, and in this video, I'm going to get out my crystal ball and let you know when the housing market is going to crash. Now that I have your attention, and I'm sure you're seeing homes flying off the market around you and home values going crazy, which prompts the questions I've been getting a lot, when is the bubble going to burst? When is 2007, 2008 going to happen again? When is everything just going to fall apart? Well, I'm going to give you five reasons today why we're probably not going to see anything happen with home values for the next 12 to 24 months. Reason number one, a lot of homeowners actually don't even have home loans on their property. A real interesting statistic is that over 38% of homeowners own their homes free and clear. And number two are sound economic principles. Unlike 2007, 2008, and 2009, right now we have sound economic principles. Remember what you learned in school about supply and demand? Well, right now supply is extremely low, demand is extremely high, completely opposite of what happened in 2007, 2008. Home prices are going up and we'll probably see that continue for a while. Number three, home equity. I bet you didn't know that the average homeowner in the United States right now has over $200,000 worth of home equity, which is an unprecedented amount. If you were a homeowner and you had that type of home equity, would you give it back to the bank? I don't think so. And number four, higher lending standards. Unlike 2007, 2008, and 2009, lenders are much more critical with the borrowers right now, making sure they have the ability to repay. Gone are those stated income loans. And number five, which I'm sure you're hearing a lot in the news right now, forbearance. Forbearance is basically where a lender allows a borrower to basically put their payments on pause. While a lot of people took advantage of this program, I bet you didn't know that 85% of those borrowers that actually went into forbearance have come out of forbearance and have either repaid the balance in full or actually put some type of payment plan in place to get them caught up. Hopefully you feel a little bit better about where the real estate market is headed. Do you have any real estate questions that I could answer for you? I would love to hear those questions so I could answer those on future videos. This is Gordon with Arizona One Real Estate Team. I look forward to hearing from you soon.